Welcome back to Kingdom of Nerds. I'm here with Chris the Bipolar Jedi, Brian Massev Nun, and we're going to react to Immaculate, starring Sydney Sweeney, the darling of Hollywood. Have you How guys heard about happen? this? I, I've I've heard I haven't heard about this movie. I've heard about Sydney Sweeney, but I've only ever seen her in well, she's in Euphoria, which I never watched. Euphoria is amazing. I watched her, but the movie, the rom com she's in, Anybody But You, is really funny. And then I, I watched her three it. times, three times in Madam Web. I got drugged that movie three times. Oh jeez. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh -huh. It's so bad it's good though. It's a great movie. I know, um, Brian, you don't like you're not a big fan of horror movies. I like I the religious it's... horror films. Those are always yes. fun. Yes, so they, uh, hopefully there'll be some priest and nun. Well, the nun on screen. The so, first omen looked crazy, or whatever the fuck it is. The omen looks nuts. Uh, maybe we should react to that too. All right, let's let's take a look at this video and see if it's worth our time. Our time. Uh oh. Oh fuck. Holy shit. <laughs> Damn. I know God's taking care of us in bed. Uh we're gonna get to see some sweet Sydney Sweeney boobs. This one for sure. She's a nun. Oh damn it. Oh, I just ah, I stand Nun yeah, nun, nuns don't have boobs. <laughs> 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 I'm just saying. Oh no, let, let me just do this before this shrink. <laughs> as I, as he says, nun boobs. They're taking a bath together. Oh. All right, back to the trailer. <laughs> <laughs> it's a miracle. What? Oh, she's, she's pregnant. Oh, fuck! Mary, mother of God. Yo, I'm here for it. I'll watch some shit like that. Damien, it's, it's all for you. Yeah, it, yeah, it literally feels like the old man. How can yeah. <laughs> Yo, that's the, the only Rosemary's baby. Oh together. shit, that's basically what this movie is. Come on, man! I don't like jump scares. This is bullshit. Be quiet and take it. Oh, damn! The domineering over here. Suffering. 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 You should laugh. Oh, she says suffering one more time, dude. All right. Did you guys see that? A movie of nothing but jump scares. Have you guys noticed? Too. They're going to focus a lot on her boobs in this. I could see it now. That's what I said. <laughs> I see nips in the trailer. Wow. That's a great cut. I'm not even trying to hide it. Oh. <laughs> well, this is a great um great scene right here. Wow, this is um this trailer's kick ass. Jump the scares. I see we... is that she's she's aquatically crucified. That's actual that's actual symbolism from the Bible. Not just you, Jesus you... on the cross, but aquatic symbolism like there are aquatic aquatic crucifixion um i wasn't i wasn't expecting um immaculate conception to start off the trail i was like wait what yeah then she's pregnant like what the fuck yeah. that, that that's i'll watch it i'll watch it fuck it i'm yeah there. i don't uh, like a lot of jump scares though man that bothers me i'm all in for this movie i love horror movies especially religious horror like brian said you know Anything my least with... favorite genre of horror Besides the, torture porn, besides the torture porn bullshit, like, like I don't want to watch. I don't want to watch. Hostile? Yeah, I don't know <laughs> what Saw over and over. I definitely don't give a shit about uh, uh, um, the human centipede, shit like that, that shock stuff. Yeah. But yeah, after yeah. that, the one thing that's always freaked me out the most, when, even growing up, the scariest movies, I don't know if it's because of the choir music or what, but it's always the religious horror. Well, it's because have you ever been to church? You know, it's got that feeling uh, like church is scary. Sometimes the Catholic Church, when you Catholic walk in, church was, bitches, yeah, you know, Catholic Church, 
kind of gothic, man. Some of them kind no, of. No, I, I was raised at communion, all that. I did it all, guys. I did it all. Yeah, Let me tell you something. Too, man. So scary, it's like... scary place. It can be very. Funerals take 11 hours. It's nuts, you know. But I. But like, when, okay, Brian, you remember the Damien. Every mass is a little funeral. Da, 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 and then Damien. there's a funeral in every mass. Okay. Jerry Goldsmith doing the freaking score for the Omen. Okay. That so made that be just as scary as so you could possibly scary. ever get, dude. Like, it, and it I've watched level. I've watched movies movie. like uh, The Exorcist, Beyond the Door, uh, all that, all that exorcism shit's scary to me, man. Like, uh, um, let me let me ask you guys a question about the whole immaculate conception. You think it's God's child or Satan's? Well, in this movie or in reality? Yeah, in this movie. As, oh okay. I, was, I thought you were talking about in real. I was like, dude, you, dude, that's gonna take forever to try to explain. <laughs> um, I think in this movie, the way she's able to look up, dude. I don't know though, but yeah, you know, that's a good. I bro, that's yeah. a fucking good catch, man. Because God, it was God's baby, and all these people are looking at her like she's a sinner, and they got to get rid of this baby. Mm -hmm. God would give her the power to protect herself. And uh, I don't know if you noticed, um. When I mean, she's laying down, I think she gets. I, I think you're gonna get the Rick roll. The, it, the, and I, you know, you noticed um on her foot, the the crucifixion was burned into her foot. Yeah. So. Yeah. I don't think I don't think um the Christ would need a, a crucifix to the foot. <laughs> no, but I'm saying antichrist. Like, yes. The people might have done that to her. She might yeah, be being assume she's carrying. Yeah, the devil they're assuming she's carrying reality. the devil's spawn. She's being abused, and the reason she has these powers to look at a window and have somebody—it's all for you, Damien—and swan dive out that motherfucker. It's because maybe Jesus gave it. That's a good catch, Bruce. That might be the switch we've never seen. Uh, yep. Rosemary's baby, Jesus's baby, like for real, dude. That's crazy. That could that could work out. That makes not yeah. makes me want to watch the movie. I you know, because right. when, as you notice in a lot. Of, well, even in real life, if something like this happened in real life, you have half the people praising the baby and, and the other, other half trying to, kill it. trying to kill her. Or, well, maybe not because kill her, they, but they're definitely trying to cancel that baby well, on they'll, Twitter. They'll try to kill her. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, like in today's society, like, I don't know, back then it must have just been easy to fall for miracles. Because in today's yeah. society, is it, like... For real, if Jesus ever really does come back, if that's a real thing, and Jesus ever really does come, no one's gonna believe it. <laughs> no one's gonna believe him. Like, get the, gonna, like, get the all we'll do, here. all we'll do is fight over it. Yeah, all we'll do is hey, fight man, over all, it. That homeless guy's back again. <laughs> and you see this, and if you see this part right here, you know they put her up as a symbol. Yeah, no, that look at what she's wearing. Look yep. at what she's wearing. They've literally got her dressed like the Virgin Mary. Virgin Mary. So I am all in for this. I am all in it, all in it, all in for this. I will say my three Hail Marys later. Three. I'm, I, I'm giving. I need three after all oh, after this. After movie. after watching that, you're gonna need yeah. about thirty. Thirty. You got you got you got a very lenient priest if he only let, if you got away with ever doing three Hail Marys for anything. Well, you you never met my priest. Okay, I'm, I'm, dude. Is. One in, okay. dude. One in, okay. one Brian. Remember, for one impure, one impure thought, we'd get ten. We would get ten Jeez. just for an impure thought. Oh no, dude! I came, I came to the church in the late nineties, dude. They did away with all that crap. Oh yeah, I had it my whole life. I was raised that way. Yeah. So I'm giving this trailer a ten out of ten because it looks freaking amazing. The symbolism, and they got it us guessing as to what the plot of this movie is, and it, they didn't reveal it, and that was good for me. I hate movie trailers that revealed the plot. Of the movie. And it's scary for me because it's literally making me relive my Catholic upbringing and the Catholicism that I dealt with as a child that was very traumatic. I mean, I never got touched or anything. Hey, whoa, was, whoa, whoa, wrong but shame, I, wrong shame. But I was, but I was an altar boy. I was, uh, uh, I got my, I got my all my communions. I did it all, and I'm telling you, Catholic Church is, that's right. They are, they're scary, man. They are. I mean, you know I, don't, no, 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 it's not. I don't like, I don't like them because they're scary. I like the fact that when you walk into a church, you feel like you're in a place that's holy it's, it's yeah it's, well it's, it's, catholic church you feel like when you walk in it's called your uh it's i think it's called your conviction that you feel you're being judged when you i dirty. went to um uh, when i went to canada as part of world youth day in 2002 
um, we saw some like church or basilicas that were built in like in in the Montreal area. There's a really big, really nice one uh, that was built like 200 years ago. Oh yeah, Chicago uh, has gorgeous ones. So does New York. It, I can't imagine it. Like beautiful, like. like uh yeah no especially with the french canadians because that was really big in catholicism before the revolution yeah new uh, york and yeah. new york and chicago that's italian made this is, this is made by a swap uh, so we is italian but, made we were all but not to get not to get off um i like the, the spaghetti here. feed that was <laughs> bruce bruce not said no wrong here. stream chris chris wrong stream uh what do you guys give this trailer out of a 10 I'm gonna give this. I, I this is I this is scary to me. I'll give this an eight. This is a good looking trailer. I like Sydney Sweeney, and you know Sydney Sweeney had to go through in this movie what I had to go through when I was in Catholic Church. She had to talk to seven different pieces people just to get her message to God. I had to talk to like the priest. I had to I had to do the Hail Mary thing. I had to confess to Mary. I wonder if they're gonna have all that symbolism in here because she they've already got to dress like Virgin. Yeah, eight yeah. Virgin Mary. Brian, what do you, what do you say? Ah, uh, it looks interesting. Uh, like I said, it's kind of in my wheelhouse as far as uh, horror films are concerned. But I'll probably watch it when it's out on, you know. I ain't digging streaming. all the jump stairs though, Bruce. That's for sure. That was dude, just that's sit just, there and watch it. That's just the trailers. Can you imagine what the movie's gonna? Have? That's just unless they I put know. all the best shit in the trailer. All right. Thank you, everyone, for tuning in to our reaction video to Immaculate starring Sydney Sweeney. Yeah, Come yeah, back yeah. later. We will be doing more reaction videos. Thank you and good night, guys. It's not just starring Sydney Sweeney, it's also starring God. <laughs> God you did not give you did actor. not give God his due. You owe God is a supporting actor. <laughs>